Proudly covering all of Northeastern and Central Pennsylvania, this is Eyewitness News. Good morning and thank you for joining us. It is Thursday, June 17th. I'm Kelly Byrne. We are getting right to your forecast with Sammy Squires. Good morning to you, Sammy. Good morning, Kelly. We're waking up to very cool air, but as the day goes on, it's going to feel very nice outside. Plus, as this high pressure is really settling down in our area, it's bringing us more sunshine for the afternoon and little to no cloud cover. Moving into our Friday, we'll start off seeing partly sunny conditions, but late in the day, we are tracking more showers heading into our area. That'll primarily happen after the sun goes down. So while we do have a gorgeous day ahead for us, temperatures will be climbing into the low to mid 70s and even the upper 70s later on today. Highs around 76, sunny and warm, very pleasant. Tonight, though, we'll be heading back down into the lower 50s, mostly clear and a cool evening for us. I'll get into more on tomorrow's forecast in just a little bit, Kelly. All right, Sammy, thank you. A local pizza shop is heavily damaged in a late night fire. Flames broke out around 11 o'clock last night at Classic Pizza in Larksville, located at the end of the Cary Avenue Bridge. When crews arrived, flames could be seen coming from the front windows. The business was closed at the time of the fire and no injuries were reported. A state police fire marshal will investigate the cause. It was just announced earlier this week there were plans to demolish the pizza shop to make way for a new Sheets convenience store. Police are looking for a man wanted in connection with an aggravated assault in Luzerne County. Anthony Gambarazio is accused of robbing and shooting a man on West Magnolia Street on Tuesday. Hazelton police say he and a second man who eyewitnesses say is his brother assaulted the victim. They also say Gambarazio beat and pistol whipped the man. The victim was taken to the hospital with non life threatening injuries. Anyone with information should contact police. And if you'd like more of our top headlines or your full forecast, make sure you go to our website right now. It is pahomepage.com.